Hello everybody and welcome to Germany. We are in our Euro tour phase of the year where we spend a week or so traveling around Europe and we are in, as I say, in Germany, in Einbeck, which is pretty much slap bang in the middle of Germany. And we've been at the detailing convention, which is a really interesting show. It's the first inaugural detailing convention. Yeah, that's right. And it's been put together by some guys who are big on YouTube and big into detailing and they've really sort of well connected the industry and what's been really good to see is big companies like Flex, like Sonax, like Colorlock have all come around and they've um, basically sponsored the show so it can happen, which is, which is very cool. And furthermore, Flex have bought out a couple of products as a sort of soft, unofficial launch <laughs> for us internal trade guys to have a look. So I thought it would be my mission, more or less, uh, to show you guys the products. Uh, we did a little video earlier today on uh, YouTube and Insta and Facebook to get some feedback and to know what sort of questions people had about it. So what we're going to do is put the questions to the experts. Um, now, we have Martin, who you might recognize from our last Euro tour, Martin Seidler. Yep. And uh, he is the product expert for many items, including machine polishers, but not that light. So we're going to ask as many <laughs> technical questions as possible and just see if he can cope. Um, and then we have Michael Marks. And um, your, what's your role within Flex? Um, I'm a detailer. But I have my own workshop in, uh, here in Germany. And uh, I'm a, in a corporation with Flex and I'm a master trainer for... A professional car care for Sonax. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, Sonax too? Yes, and uh, I work together with, uh, with Flex. With Flex. And yeah. where, where are you based in Germany? Uh, in um, uh, Near Stuttgart. Near Stuttgart? Oh, so a bit further south from yeah, Stuttgart. Yeah, it's uh, 400 kilometers from here. <laughs> it's, uh, uh, it's nothing. No, it's nothing. <laughs> <laughs> nothing. <laughs> the nothing. Yeah, it's, yeah. Yeah. Oh, far away. it's 20 minutes on the yeah, autobahn. 20 minutes, yeah. <laughs> Very scary, 20 minutes. Yeah. Um, so, without further ado, let's start talking about some products here. Yeah. Um, you guys have pretty much led the way in terms of cordless machine polishers. Yeah. Some people bought out other ones. Was it Makita have a, have a cordless one? Uh, obviously, Rupes with the Hybrid Nano is cordless. But when it comes to mainstream full-size tools, you guys have, have really been the leading light um, over the last couple of years. And obviously, you are backed by a big company with, with um, lots of um, specialism and expertise in lithium battery technology, mm -hmm. which has obviously helped you get there. Yeah. Um, which is, again, really useful for us of us. And um, I feel that Flex is sort of on the up and up in the detailing because you obviously do uh, machines and power tools for different industries, uh, but that the detailing side in the past has been a little tiny bit, but now... That's right. It's going bigger and bigger. It yeah. does. Yeah. I was talking to uh, the uh, Stuart in the UK, mm -hmm. who, Stuart Kulkoff, who, who runs the UK, and he said that the automotive detailing side is the biggest expansion market mm -hmm. That's right. um, of all the machines you do. Yeah. Um, and they produce all sorts of bits and bobs, including something called the giraffe, but um, we've talked about the giraffe. You can Google it, Google Flex Giraffe, um, and turn Safe Search on. Um, so, uh, as I say, without further ado, let's look at the light first, shall we? Okay. The light is a professional detailing light. is a, a, a perfect add-on tool for, for all the detailers. And the the best of all the best of the tool is you can use our battery system that means you can use our 18 volt and 10.8 batteries in that light so that's perfect the light himself is um, has bluetooth connected you can change the color you can change the brightness and yeah, it's a perfect mobile light. Indeed, and it's, is it, it's designed primarily for detailing, is it, or is it a sort of a general purpose light? Yeah, it's, it's, uh, the main focus was for us uh, the detailing, but you can use it everywhere. Gotcha, yes. it has an overall thing. And it says with a Bluetooth connection, I'm guessing, does that go to an app that's on your phone? Yeah, yeah. Uh, at the moment, um, we have only an Android app. Okay. Um, the, the um, iPhone, the oh, Apple iOS, app, iOS, yeah, yeah. The iOS app, um, they, they check that at the moment and I think when we have the, the light in stock in the next few months, I yeah, think, I hope so. <laughs> we have also the, the app in the App Store. 
That'd be brilliant. Yeah, that'd be brilliant. And um, should we turn it on and have a play? Yeah. I've been looking at these all day at the show, um, and they go mighty bright as well. Um, and actually, you might be thinking, oh, you want the brightest light possible, but actually it's not always about the very brightness of it. It's about the colour, it's about the spread, it's about the beam pattern. So let's see if we can completely mess up that camera by shining it at its... I'll go up the stages with it. Okay, so let's start. Okay, I'm just going to stick this here so we see what you're doing with your fingers. I start um, the light. Yeah. And then you press... Oh, sorry. So... We can change here the light color with plus and minus. Okay, so do you know what range the light color goes through? Does it list it there? Uh, not really. No. <laughs> but it's going to be within a useful spectrum. You, you can use it from uh, a blue light to mm -hmm. until um, a red. A red, so a warm, yeah. gotcha. So the blue light is going to be a higher uh, Kelvin rating. Warm, and, warm, warm and, and cold light. light. Yeah, perception. Um, and as you mentioned earlier, uh, we're currently running on the 18 volt program, but I imagine it's just as bright with the 10.8 volt. 10.8, yeah. Um, so it works with both those, and it's nice if you've got the whole range of flex polishers and accessories. No, they're very cool though. So I'm just I'm just using the uh, little uh, thingamajiggles to take some images. It's got lots of flashing lights and clever stuff like that, and it's flashing as well down to 10%. Is that battery or? And uh, not a battery. That's normally the brightness of the light. I don't know why. <laughs> turn it off and put the battery outside. So this is, as I say, it's not actually in production. Well, it might be in production, but it's not. No. It's only, that's, that's my, my um, mistake. Mm -hmm. um, so now it works. Is that because you haven't put the battery yeah. properly? Yeah. Yeah. Um, and now you can turn on and change the brightness of the light. And that is seriously, seriously yeah. bright. If you point that at the camera, um, you'll probably be able to bleach everything out. Uh, <laughs> yes, it's going to really upset the edit. Um, cool, okie okay, dokie. So that's the light, and cost-wise, we don't know exact prices yet, but we're thinking um, it's going to be... 100, uh, 50, 160. That's for, the, for the light unit, and as with a lot of the flex cordless tools, the idea is you can buy the tool on its own, or you can buy it with the batteries and the charger, um, and so that way, if you've already got the batteries and the charger, you're not paying double for it. Yeah. Um, and you've got a, a bit of a tripod behind you as well. Yeah. Um, and that thing, if you pull it in this direction, I think it will then yeah. be in frame. And when you, I tell you what, you were very good at twiddling this on earlier. Why don't you demonstrate <laughs> how this goes? It's well, um, we have we have also a, yeah. a, a little yeah funny thing. If your batteries are empty mm -hmm. and you was, want to change or to want to charge the battery, you have no light, but it works. It works without batteries. We have a have you broken bank. the laws of physics or has that got a battery on board? Yeah, it's a power bank inside. Okay. And so you can work That's without cool. battery. And do you charge that directly for the power bank or does it just take it from the battery no, and it's it's you take it from the battery? That's brilliant. How long does that emergency light work for? That's also a question I can't answer you. So. For the lights today, the, the works the whole, works day, the whole yeah. day. Yeah, yeah. Day, yeah, yeah. Ten hours. Well, there's no problems. Uh, it's the joy of LED technology, I guess. It right? started at nine o'clock, nine yeah. thirty, and it's now and uh, now and the he says like still burns. Yeah, that's the clock. Look at this. Yeah. Clock. <laughs> Somebody's written a rude word on this. I can't. It's not the time. Um, so this little um, tripod goes up really quite high as well. It's it's yeah. got nice wide legs as well, so um, it will be nice and stable. And has it got any brakes on those wheels, or is that something? Yeah, that yeah. Added? There's two brakes on the wheels. Cool. So you can fix it and. Very big arms. You like big arms? Stable. Yeah. yeah. That's cool. Right, now, enough of that. Let's go on to the magic box. Okay. Um, so, this is the big one. This is the PXE. Uh, I'm not going to beat you out the bush. That's what it looks like. Um, it is hunkier than a Rupes Hybrid Nano. Uh, however, in return for the hunkiness, you also get more power, um, more output in, in that regard, and a couple of other clever features that are both either unique or common with other small polishers. Um, Price-wise, we've been looking around and it's going to be similar to the hybrid, maybe a bit less. No, um, not a bit less, it's a, a big. A big, a big, yeah. Okay. Um, so our base tool, that means our bare tool we call, it's only that tool. It uh, costs um, 199 euros. Right. It's four additional. Gotcha. And the set version, that means um, the tool with the different drive type, with the two different drive types, with, mm -hmm. the, two, with the three 
three different um, backing blades. So what we're talking about with drive type here is, is these are these things, aren't they? These are counterweighted for DA movement. Yeah, yeah. And you've got two of them. So uh, what's two, the is it two, different strokes? Um, is it three millimeters? No, that's a, no, this, that's this, a this three millimeter. Three millimeter. And, that's a and that's a twelve millimeter stroke. Okay. And so yeah, yeah, yeah. things. And then you have also the rotor. This is the right. rotor attachment. So again, yeah. like the hybrid, you've got that multifunction ability with yeah. it. And then you have the three different um, backing blades. We have a 30 millimeter backing blade with uh, four um, sanding, sanding, sanding pads okay, spot yeah, pads, for spot yeah. pads. And we have a Velcro 30 millimeter and uh, a 75 millimeter Velcro yeah. pads for, for uh, the foam pads or also for sanding pads. Gotcha. And you can combine the 75 millimeters with a 12 millimeter stroke um, direction, yeah. Yeah. or with a three millimeter yeah. stroke, All but not, oh, not with a with a rotary. It's it's it doesn't work. Okay. So it's for safety, only for safety. So we don't know what end users do. Pack that big big um, foam pad on on top, and then it can be. Uh, you're flying around, so flying around, yeah. and it's only for safety. But you can combine all the three different drive types with the small ones. So that means you have a, a very big range of combinations. Normally, um, the combination is a, a rotary with a small pad with a small vacuum yeah. pad, and for spot sanding, three millimeter. Uh, DA with uh, the the larger pad, the, the, the glue pads, yes, and the 12 millimeter with 75. I mean, that 12 with a 75, that's that's a real selling point over other small machines because yeah. many of them are limited to small ones; they don't have the power really to mm -hmm. work it. Mm -hmm. um, and that on a long throw or medium throw DA has it's got a lot of power as a tool. It goes up yeah. against its more mainstream tools in some ways. Um, now, what I like about this as well, um, I've been reading up a little bit, so I'm going to get my geek on. Um, but first, before we do that, I just want to clarify on the prices. So the tool itself is 199 euros. 199 yeah. euros. And the set, it means the drive types, the backing blades, two batteries, and the charger, mm -hmm. the small ones. Gotcha. The little batteries, this is a big battery. That's it? a big one. Okay, so small ones. Uh, as a set version, it uh, the pricing is uh, three fifty nine euros, okay. and the complete set with polished component, foam pads, different foam pads, uh, micro vibe, um with lots of lovely bits and bobs. Yeah. We'll, we'll we'll do some passers by, but we've got here we've got foam. I mean we've got wool, we've got two foam. Um, the green's more aggressive. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, and then we've got little foam ones. Oh, you've got the nice edging on that, so that's got yeah, quite a big effect. New, new one. Ooh, yeah. We have within the past. Um, ah, okay, it's a special cut in here. Yeah, go over here and over this place. It's good, better for edging. Yeah, it's very flexible, but uh, like very hard. Okay. We have in the past only the dimension for the the foam pads, um, fifty millimeters and eighty millimeters, and brand new is sixty millimeter. Head side. Yeah, and the, the complete set, uh, the pricing is uh, four twenty nine oh, euros. So yeah. that's 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 so very that's affordable. more yeah. than hundred euros less than the competition. Less than our. Uh, I've noticed you've, you've you've made a terrible mistake. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry to break it to you. Um, are you going to be able to fix that? <laughs> You you know that we have a special <laughs> a special section special for the UK. Special for you. Special class for special people. <laughs> Indeed. Well, I'm special people. Just having a look in here, we've got the nice big charger. And the nice thing here is that the, the batteries have two capacities. So you're saying that the pack comes with two times two and a half amps? Three capacities. Three, three capacities. Have, okay. we have We have a 2.5. Yeah. That's a small one. And we have a, five, a four. Four. And mm. we have a six. It's the same dimension like um, the four, mm -hmm. um, but we'll, we have the biggest one is the six amp. Six amp. And how much running time does the six amp give you? Uh, the six amp, one hour. One hour running. And what's Without the charge break. time on that? Uh, only 35 until 40 minutes. 
Ah, so you can have continuous running. This, I imagine, because this the um, five or six rather is going to be a little bit heavier than this, I would imagine. Yeah, I think uh, the normal combination is between 2.5 mm -hmm. and the tool. Um, the runtime is um, round about uh, 50 minutes. 50 minutes on a two yeah. and a half. The nice but thing about the but it's absolutely run time. So I think um, the typical the typical workspace, nobody works Not more more minutes. than more than no. two or three minutes yeah. with that tool on permanently. And of course, and that's you, have to, you have to wipe it off and uh, yeah, yeah, exactly. To clean the surface and then you work again. Have you been involved with the testing of this? Yeah, I tested it a month, a few months, months ago. You've seen before. this before. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think of this? Have you used the other other machines on the market? Yes, yes, yes. I used the 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 the, 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 the hybrid, mm -hmm. and uh, it's 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 a very good machine. Yeah, but uh, this one is a very special too. <laughs> yes, yeah, this is. A, it's um, very strong. It's a yeah. Um, that's that's the thing I get exactly. It's, yeah. it's, it's, it's it's a meaty thing, and we've got a digital power control here. We've got soft start trigger, um, and the trigger locks as well to so leave it on permanently. Um, it's actually not very loud. There's no real whistle to it. Um, the batteries are really easy to swap in and out. I can see this. That's All good. Nice. <laughs> it, is it is life indeed. Um, we have to start again. <laughs> yeah, All over again. Yes. All over again. It's your fault. <laughs> so, um, in summary, with the brushless motor, the lithium, uh, the bigger batteries as well, I didn't know there was such a range of batteries. Um, do you know what wattage this puts out? What power? You, what, what do you mean with, with power? Um, what? As in, it's watts, what? exactly. What? When you have a mains powered machine, you say uh, No, no, no. Uh, you, you can't talk about power if you talk about battery tools. That's, you can um, have a look to, to different formulas about... Um, Does they give power for a Tesla? I mean, uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, you have... You, you know our um, XFE712? Yes. And it's nearly the same power or the same power. You can do everything with that tool, with that battery tool. What you do with the with the XFA with the quarter. And that's what a lot of people aren't um, aren't convinced by. Should we say they're used to power? They're used to cables. I think it can't possibly be powered. This is powered by a nuclear power station if it's on a cable. Mm -hmm. um, and from everyone I've talked to, has actually used them, with one or two exceptions. Um, they are just as powerful as the main sort of mains powered counterparts. Um, and as I say, what I like about this is the grip, the, the build quality feels good, uh, it's nice and flexible, the price point is really, really good. Now, one thing that has already been commented on um, from online stuff when we first revealed this is um, it's in terms of access of small areas, the Rupes they do a long, a long neck and a short neck. And the Rupes is a sort of is a slightly more delicate lady of a machine. It's, it's a thinner, a sort of slightly elegant, whereas this is more like a bodybuilder. Are you, yeah, yeah. Are you yeah. going to do any ex extension bars? Are you going to do any different models of this? Um, are you allowed to tell me? You should do anyway. think about a lot of interesting accessories in the future. That sounds like a very corporately approved response. So the answer is there will be <laughs> extension bars. There may be alternative versions. Um, and if there aren't, what you do is complain to Martin. He's Martin Seidler. I'll give you his full phone number and address in, in the lower. No. <laughs> And he thinks I'm joking. Um, so, um, thank you very much for taking the time. I uh, really, you. really appreciate it. Have you enjoyed today? Have you enjoyed the show? Yeah, definitely. We were well impressed. Uh, we not uh, not expected so much uh, visitors mm -hmm. and uh, we were interested. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, professionals, yeah. Yeah. semi professionals. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it it was a success for us. Yes, yeah. So we'll be back next year. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> it's been a pleasure. Thank you very much for your time. Very much appreciated. You're welcome. And we're looking forward to getting some, our hands on one of these in, in the UK. Don't worry about fixing the terrible plug that you put in. <laughs> Should we take this one? Take no, 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 no. Show me my special one. Your special one. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> special baby. Yeah, no, that's absolutely But uh, we have that tool in stock in week 42, Two. 43. Which is okay. October. Yeah. It is October. So I thought this was going to come out at SEMA, but it will already be in customer hands in SEMA. And will it be immediately available in the UK? Or are we going to have to wait? Or is it going to come to the UK? Uh, I think for the UK, we must change the plug. Yes. So it takes a little bit more time. It's only three wires. <laughs> <laughs>
Ja, det, 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 the German one or the European one um, is uh, available in week 42. Okay, well, I'll, I'll yeah. call you up in week 43. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. Well, let's get downstairs and let's get back to the show. Yeah, okay. perfectly.